They are twins who became YouTube stars by pulling pranks, but cops say this time they went too far. Yeah, of course they went too far when they're doing illegal things and calling them pranks. Does that not fucking click in your head? Showed me how to lift diamond rings, Porsches and paintings, we took the finer things. You told me. What is up guys, Justin197 here. I know I am late to the party and they probably deleted the video because I couldn't find it on their YouTube channel, but yeah, they're just idiots. I wanted to do this sooner, but Happy Wars, I'm not even joking, hurt my head so much. I had like two days of a freaking headache and then I am a part of something on the Real RP Cheese channel. By the way, if you want to join this little act, you can just comment down below if you want to join the war we apparently have 10 people and we are waiting we have seven people already done with their little part in the video which is pretty good now anyways beyond that these people are probably retarded in case we haven't noticed they are pulling bank robberies they are doing criminal acts and yet they're trying to say it was a prank it was a prank no it was not a prank i don't know what happened to these pranks like the good old days we we had like what gum in your chair with the thumbtack as well we had like oh i don't know spit, uh, putting a bucket of water on top of the door we had like decent pranks that were pranks but nowadays it's just Hey guys, I'm going to shove this tampon up my butthole and we're going to go see if anybody gets offended and then we're going to say it was a prank, bro. Like, how does that fucking make any sense? And yes, people would probably do that because pranks these days don't make any sense. Pretty soon it's going to be like, hey guys, I'm going to giving my friend the coronavirus, but I don't actually have the coronavirus. We're, we're going to prank these people. Like, what the fuck? D do you really want to like sink so low? Do you really? Is this your type of clout? trying to be retarded like these people need to die off like really fast and i have never heard of these people and you know what's even sad their freaking youtube has 4.84 million subscribers at least during the making of this video after that dilemma we can let's start this stupid ass fucking video that we're all going to hate this prank is backfiring badly for these two brothers now 23 year old twins alan and alex stokes are facing criminal charges you can clearly see that they're literally doing it in public so i don't know if these things were hiring or not if there's some hired people but just know if these got like i don't think that he's even true anymore sent beyond the circumstances or maybe like other people were seeing it and they had like paid people but then like the non-payers were like holy shit this is actually real let me go call the cops and it's really weird because when you're looking at them they're literally smiling about it like i don't i don't know what the fuck kind of thing is that you can literally see see that people are w looking at them they're all dressed up that this is not a prank you know pranks are supposed to be harmless fun not let me get arrested oh prank gone fucking wrong prank gone viral this is like the most stupidest thing it's like the same thing with the other prank that i might go on here because we all know the little muslim prank if you don't know what that is there is this prank where people basically dress up in like muslim clothes because i don't know if it was based on 9-11 or whatever but it was supposed to be because of terrorist act they have a bag and they throw it on the ground and everybody runs because they think it's a bomb but this dude did it for real there was no hired actors or anything he literally flat out went over to somebody and did it and he literally faced charges he's i don't know if he's still in jail but he went to jail pranks are only supposed to be fun harmless acts like i said already not let me go get arrested that is just the stupidest thing and you can clearly see that why would anybody not call the cops why would nobody call the cops on a bank robbery that, that makes no sense but also too who the hell still robs a bank nowadays this was not a prank this was criminal activity thank you i've already addressed that the twins posted video on youtube laying out the prank why the fuck are you laughing like this is the other thing the, i feel like these guys are also too like psychotic in the mind because why the hell are you laughing about this this is not funny whatsoever this is why i know for a fact that when people like them 
get all these subscribers they lose common sense so the douchebag inside them grow and then they'll become these fucking psychotic bitches who literally think that killing people or whatever is a good thing and since they have a big fan base they can literally simp for them and defend their asses which is fucking ridiculous we're gonna be running around in front of people and making it seem like we just got done robbing a bank Wearing masks and clutching bags, they run through the crowd in Irvine, California. This startled bystander gets out of the way quick. Oh well, yeah, I mean, they're bank robbers. I don't understand too, they don't have guns, so like, they can't really do much, like, you know, damage or anything. They can't really do it. So, I mean, you don't even like see anything that they could threaten somebody with. So that's actually too kind of weird i don't understand how that would make sense but anyways the twins drop money as they flee they leap into an uber but the driver refuses to uber, take them uber for off my no we're gonna get caught okay yeah i don't know if and i think you can probably tell too this is pretty stupid how these people would think that they're bank robbers they are literally the most stupidest idiotic people to rob a bank. They can't even put, they can't even keep the money in the bag. They literally are going in an Uber. This is like, this, <laughs> this doesn't make no sense at all. Like, it's not, I know it's not a prank, but the thing is, if you're trying to make it seem realistic and trying to say you're pranking, this is like, not even looking at all correct it literally looks like crap it looked like they just pulled something out of your ass and say oh yeah this is what bank robbers do they probably watch the comedy and say oh wow we should we can do the same thing we can trip down laugh at everybody and be so downright idiotic witnesses who thought it was the real deal called 911 you guys just get out of an uber a minute ago a squad of cops showed up and when they realized it was all a prank they were not amused no shit what do you think people are gonna do Right? And you're lucky you didn't get any guns drawn. You're absolutely lucky you didn't get any guns drawn. Yeah, that is true. But I don't know who is going to pull a gun out on them. I mean, there wasn't even, like, any cops in the area at all, which is pretty weird. That's that's the other thing I don't get. Where is all the cops while they're filming? Did they, like, f see, oh, wait, the cops are here. Let, let's not film. And then wait until the cops leave and then they start filming it. Because that's kind of weird how the, that never happened or never occurred at all anywhere in the videos that they were producing until like they got confronted because of all the 911 calls. You see how weird that is now? We spoke to Orange County District Attorney Todd Spitzer. If you're engaging in criminal activity in order to increase your ratings or increase your sensationalism on YouTube, and you cross the line and violate the law, you're going to be prosecuted. Yeah, I think we understand that. And I mean, I'm literally kept saying that it's an illegal act. You will go to jail with it. I mean, it literally is facts. But you see here, douche tubers don't understand that. They think, oh, wow, we have a big fan base and we have all this money. Oh, we can do whatever we want. Screw the police. Screw the law. We, even though we're, you know, supposed to be following it. But, you know, screw that. We're millionaires, bitches. We can do whatever we want. We can fist any woman on the street, too. It's not that hard. It's not sexual harassment because we're famous, boys. The prank happened last October, but the twins were just charged with false imprisonment and falsely reporting an emergency. Th wait, this happened in October? Wait, then why are people fucking saying it now? If it happened in October, what? Yeah, this is, this is the end of the video, all right, but now I'm confused. Why are people talking about it now, then, if it happened in October? And when in October? Was it like 2019 or something? Like, now, now I don't even know if the video is actually still on their video, on their thing. I thought this literally just happened, like, you know, now. Because why the hell are people talking about it? You see how that doesn't make any sense? Why are you talking about it now? This is, I, I'm literally just amazed of how late this was. I, I'm just, dang. And I thought I was, like, late to the party, but no, no. These people literally waited what i don't even know if it was a year or two but like october seriously unless they got it wrong no it's not even true i mean 
if you even look at their stuff, I'm trying to find it. It apparently is um, not there, but there is a video from two years ago that says crazy dares in grocery store. We got arrested. So they were already doing these kinds of stuffs back then and they got arrested for it. But that was dares. Now they're like, you know, dares wasn't that bad. How about we get in trouble for something that is actually bad? Really? Fucking retards, dude. I swear to God. Don't be a douche tuber and know your, know your place in the world. You do pranks, make sure the pranks are innocent. Not let me go abortion prank my husband or let me be a gay prank to my girlfriend or something so stupid and idiotic on them. Like this video if you like it very much. Dislike this video if you're a dick and you actually think these guys shouldn't get arrested for quote unquote pranking. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Join, this, join the war boys. It's going to be a magical treat. And yeah, these people suck dick. Literally. My